We'll look at how you can do some minor changes in your diet and get big results. That's right. Joining us with some really clever ways to change your diet and help you slim down, Joy Bauer. She's the Today Show's nutrition and health expert and the best-selling author of the Joy Yay! Fit Club Cookbook, Diet Plan, and Inspiration. Uh, Joy, it's so good to hey, see you. Hey, it's great to be here. Thanks for and, having me. And what's, me. Uh, what I love about these these tips are that they're, they're pretty simple things. Starting off with your morning cup of joe. Very simple. So all of us love to have coffee in the morning, whether it's caffeinated or decaf. And what do we put in it? We put the cream and a whole lot of sugar. So if you simply swap the cream for skim milk, soy milk, or unsweetened almond milk, mm -hmm. and then go from a couple of packets of sugar to one, you can literally save over 27,000 calories at the end of a year. Whoa, that's and a lot can, of pounds. It's a lot of pounds. It definitely translates on that scale. And it's not an easy swap. You can train your taste buds to like your morning joe a little bit lighter. Okay, mm -hmm. is this whole thing true that if you drink water before a meal, you're not gonna eat as much? Believe it or not, it is. We have research that shows if you guzzle oh, just- Oh, study. <laughs> right, another study. We love those studies, but if you guzzle just two cups of water, that's 16 ounces, before lunch and before dinner, and this makes perfect sense, it takes up belly space, uh -huh. so it's going to fill you up slightly, and then you're going to pull back at the main meal. So it, it absolutely will help. And you have to get him help. to go to the bathroom a bunch, so you maybe won't burn as calories. much either, right? Yes. And if you want it, you she want it added edge. She always brings it back to the bathroom. That's, that's my goal. Us women like to go to the bathroom <laughs> yes. a lot. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. if you in want an added edge, what you could do, you're so right about that. We primp in there as well. We talk, we chat. Um, swip, swap the water occasionally for green tea, because okay. green tea has this added edge of slightly revving your metabolism. So oh. now in the summer months, it could be ice green tea or hot green tea. Or maybe you want cayenne to skip and the lemon, sugar. that mm -hmm. type of thing yeah. too. Okay, and then quickly, uh, you say when you're, when you're preparing your foods, spray, don't pour. Right, so we know that heart healthy oils like olive oil and grapeseed oil and canola oil are so good for you and they could drive down cholesterol, but you take it from the bottle, you pour it on the skillet, mm -hmm. every tablespoon's 120 calories. So before you even add the food, that's 200 calories. So I tell people to invest in like a $15 oil mister. It's good for the environment, it will mm -hmm. save you cash versus buying the canisters each week. And then you spray the skillet and you can cover that surface area with less than a teaspoon of oil, 30 calories. Okay, we have 30 seconds left. Veggies first. Why is that? Before dinner, start with a vegetable first course. It could be a gazpacho, it could be a sliced cucumber, a handful of sugar snap peas. The combination of the fiber and the water expands uh -huh. in your belly, uh -huh. fills you up, you eat less at the main meal. And you lose have, weight! And always have an exercise event on your calendar. Joy, to thanks look forward so much. To.